Hey, I'm John Dudley uh, with Citizen Zero. We're out here on tour with Amaranth and Failure Anthem, and this is our luxurious ride. So uh, as you can tell, we travel a lot as to why there's garbage bags and, and water bottles everywhere. Everyone's been a little sick, it's kind of cold here, gotta have some medicine and whatnot. You have your sunglasses. These are important. Everyone always wants to charge their phone. You gotta have the, the double little converter there. We got a pine cone. That's a great one. It's from Lake Tahoe. We didn't even stay there long. We literally stopped there for like 15 minutes, found that pine cone and left. So that was great. Got our little fishing lure there. Found that in the middle of a lake in Tennessee on one of our days off. It was pretty great. Oh yes, we have Mr. Adam Cross here, our sound guy. Hey, how you doing? Coming on in. All right. Check it out. You got anything like to say? Every in? day of our lives. Yeah, literally. We've <laughs> this tour especially has been a little grueling. We've had like some 24-hour rides in this thing. 25-hour drive. Yeah, it's been fun. Had some flat tires, Two. which is always fun, especially in the bitter cold. Yeah. Well, basically, uh, we try to split up the driving as much as we can between like me, Sammy, our guitarist. Well, doesn't drive at all. Yeah, everyone drives but the guitar. Yeah, player. we we don't trust Sammy. We don't trust <laughs> Sammy driving without a trailer. So <laughs> we're not gonna let him. Uh, you know, kill us on the road. So basically, whoever's driving, we like to have an awake, alert co-pilot. Usually two, but we're out not. The nasty <laughs> jams through the through the aux cord, of course. If I'm in the driver's seat <laughs> driving, and what what would you put on? I don't know. You'd probably uh, it, play like it, it some. It depends on the mood, you know. Yeah. Um, this morning, I, I had to drive, uh, leaving the hotel at like 7 a.m. We got like two hours of sleep. Uh, started the day <laughs> off with uh, some good old Cannibal Corpse and Rage Against the Machines, so... It, um, it definitely varies. It Honestly, depends on the mood. Especially, like, the sights you're having, too. Like, when we're out driving out west, we like to listen to Ooh, John, John Mayer. Mayer. That Paradise <laughs> yeah. Valley album is pretty good for that. Yeah, and then, uh, if you're falling asleep, I'll normally put on, like, some some heavier music. I like to listen to Trash Talk and all that stuff. Yeah. Everyone else hates it, but <laughs> that's okay. Some Lamb of God, if you will. Oh, yeah. Little Kings of Leon. We like to... It's a pretty eclectic uh, it's, music it, Yeah, it, it's literally it, everything. It varies. We've man. listened to uh, Taylor Swift and Rihanna as much as I hate to admit that. Well, only Just, on the radio <laughs> when we don't have phone service. That's true. Let's, let's clarify. We, uh, we had a 20 hour drive through, what was it, Saskatchewan <laughs> with no service, <laughs> no anything in the middle of nowhere. And for some and reason, they had a radio station that was just playing like the sludgiest doom metal <laughs> for like 45 minutes. It was the same song. I loved it, but everyone else is falling asleep. Oh, yeah. This is where the, the good stuff happens right here. Oh, As you can hey. see, <laughs> April's literally still sleeping. That's her merch girl, April. Say hi, April. Hi. She's, uh, she's asleep. But basically, uh, we we like to try to keep it clean with the seat covers. Uh, it doesn't really work that well because yeah, they just slip off. But, you know, you got to have the essentials. You got to have, like, a case of water. You got to have one Gibson Thunderbird just chilling in the back. You know, why not? In case you want to lay some nasty riffs down when you're We're playing. also fully equipped with a uh, this is CB this radio. Yeah. We've been screwing with truckers. We're not going to lie. I don't know if that's legal to say. I don't know if that's illegal to do. But we've been doing it. Well, normally, I'd say like either... April normally mans the third bench. Yeah, that, that's her yes. bench. That one's like tinier than the rest, and she's a tiny little human being. So <laughs> she fits in there real well. I think Sammy and Sam are normally here. I like co-pilot because I'm the only one that smokes cigarettes. Yeah, it's usually me and John either both in the front or both in the back. Oh yeah. Usually. And then, if you'd like to uh, step back, we did what every other touring band does. Ripped out the back two benches and made ourselves a little apartment, a little studio apartment. You know, there's no kitchen, there's no sink. We got living area, so that's good. And honestly, it's the most uncomfortable bed you've ever been on. So basically, we decided to do the storage underneath because we have a lot more gear on this tour. Couldn't really throw the bags in the trailer. Um, normally, we do this in shifts whenever someone else is driving. Like, if you just ended driving, you're normally in the bed. Um, it's pretty self-explanatory. It's, it's the most uncomfortable <laughs> bed ever. It's literally a piece Two of blue foam on wood. some wood. <laughs> And like this van is so rigid too, because the suspension has to be real stiff for towing the trailer that this thing will throw you around if you're hitting bumps. <laughs> like today we're on like some of these shitty roads that were just like I felt like I was in a moon bounce or something. It was bad. And then yeah, it's 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 
kind of smelly back here sometimes. It's bad. Yeah, a little bit. You got, you got, you know, blankets, random sticks of deodorant. You gotta have your jack, because for some reason we're cursed and always blowing tires. That's the thing on this floor. Yep. We're on a spare right now, <laughs> which is great. But yeah, that's basically it. This helps a lot, to be honest. This is this is the best uh, space. Yeah, we consumer. all brought a lot of shit with us. Unfortunately. Yeah. The trailer has been through some things. We were in Arizona like four or five months ago, coming home from a tour. I literally hit something in the road, and it spat up and just nailed this, and blew out like the undercarriage of our old van. So that was a pretty pretty good dilemma to deal with. That's from New York hitting a traffic cone. I think we've hit like some some snow plow marker things too. Oh, uh, don't forget about um, the repairs we had to do. Oh yeah, I uh, <laughs> I might have hit a couple things. The, the fender's always getting screwed up, so that's not good. And then the trailer. You got your tip with the trailer. <laughs> she's uh, she's a little beat up. No. Basically, holy shit. We literally all went to the hot springs in Banff the other day in Canada. It was so cold that we all threw our wet shit in here and it's just fucking frozen. Yeah. Absolutely just frozen. solid. But yeah, we got the clothes rack, you know, gotta keep it classy. Josh's poncho. <laughs> we just went to a radio station that gave us some Not Your Father's Root Beer, which is appreciated, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> I think they just gave it to us because no one likes we'll, it. Uh, we'll, we'll sell it um, for kidding. whiskey. How about that? Yeah, we'll trade it. <laughs> Gotta have a longboard. Ah, That's always yeah. essential. Like, showing at a venue. Like, people don't realize there's so much downtime. Yeah. At, at shows and shit. So. Yeah. <laughs> you got a lot of a lot of time to helps. go rip the board. You gotta have your Yeti cooler because for some reason that's all the rage right now. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> that's that's really that's the trailer. All right. Well, thank you for coming out and checking out our rig. I'm John from Citizen Zero. You can check us on tour. We're uh, pretty much out until we die. Um, we're on the interwebs everywhere. Citizen Zero, uh, Facebook, Instagram. We're on Spotify, Amazon, iTunes, and our website is WeAreCitizenZero.com. Thank you very much.